All right, Halos, welcome back. Uh, today we are actually doing some more of the intro or the, the uh, new bots that they have just released into League of Legends as of patch 14.6 here. Um, so we're gonna try. We just tried the new intro bots, and now we're gonna be doing the new beginner bots. This should we we should load into the game much quicker? So I'm just gonna go ahead and start uh, as we can try to find a match. Let's see how quickly we can. It says uh, 33 seconds is the estimated time, so we will see if that is true or not, but yeah. All right, there we go. Perfect. Seven, seven second queue time. That was not bad at all. Um, let's go uh, Let's go top this time, I think. <clears throat> um, the question is, should we still go Yasuo, or should we try something a little better? Um, I think Yas is probably one of the best choices, but um, let's see. Let's kind of go down the list of my most played and then kind of see. I think Volibear probably would be good. Uh, Warwick would probably be good as well. I could still do Zhen, of course, uh, if we wanted to, Zhen Zhao. Uh, but we shall see, I guess, shall we? Um, see. Someone that can just continue to auto-attack and still do lots of damage. Mordekaiser would not probably be bad too bad at all, honestly um, but he might be a little difficult it's the only problem uh, to survive really long with I mean um, <clears throat> yeah let's kind of just go down the list so we got a lot of different choices we could try some Yone I suppose um, Gangplank might be decent Set would probably be de pretty decent Viego has those resets Spellveth also has some stuff that's kind of similar to resets um, yeah, I mean, we have a lot of choices for sure, but, uh, I feel like only some of them would be good. I think we'll try the Yasuo. Um, maybe we should do the Yone, but I'm gonna try the Yasuo again. Let's go ahead and get our, uh, our summoner spells ready. Uh, this I'm gonna keep from last time. I think it was probably the best choice overall. Um, <clears throat> Generally speaking, okay, so we have uh, a Jax, a Varus, Diana. Yeah, Diana also got buffed in this uh, this patch that just came out, so that'll be interesting to see. Um, it looked like pretty decent sized buffs as well um, overall for her, so hopefully we're not gonna have to see her a ton, but uh, yeah. All right, so we're probably gonna have uh, so they have a Nocturne jungle it looks like. All right, good to know. We're probably fighting the Urgot Galio. Actually, it might be Urgot Irelia, Galio as robot. I think that would probably be more likely, assuming that it, it is the case. Um, I used to know every time whether what lane they would go to, pretty much, uh, for like certain, way back in the day, um, and it used to be unchanged, obviously. But now, um, now they've updated them. All of this changes. Like everything's way different. So it's gonna be cool learning the new uh, bots for sure. But yeah, um, there you go. Let's get straight back into it, shall we? Got a level seven uh, Diana here. Let's go. And then uh, yeah, so it should be me and Jack top, I believe, with Diana in mid, and then Varus and Jinx are gonna be bot, assuming that everyone goes to their normal, roughly normal lanes. But yeah, I guess you can, uh, I guess you can jungle now if you want, and uh, the top laner won't suffer in the, uh, <laughs> the uh, you know, the one v two as it used to be. But now it's just gonna be a one v one as a. Uh, as the enemy is, uh, oh yeah, I guess that's true. So wait, who's who's mid for them then? Maybe it's Galio mid, and um, actually I don't know. Maybe it's Aurelia mid with Ezreal, Galio, Bot, and Urgot top. I forgot about that for a second actually. So s there's definitely gonna be one person top on their team. <clears throat> um, usually I would go bot lane. Uh, generally speaking, because the bot lane turret actually, as opposed to the mid and top turret, doesn't have the debuff that mid and top turrets have. Uh, the mid and top turrets have, uh, I think, reduces 50% incoming damage from all sources, pretty much, um, uh, up until minute 5. So the bot lane turret doesn't have those extra defenses, but the mid and top turret do. So usually I go bot in, uh, obviously, bot games, I guess, or uh, co-op versus AI games, and... Uh, that is like the main thing, but obviously this is going to be a little bit different um, with the new AI and such. And if we do have two people top, that means we are in a 2v1, so it should be a much easier situation. Unless he just is scared the whole time and like sits under his turret, which would be kind of unfortunate because the enemy might not be able to get much turret damage on. So I guess we'll see what happens, um, but yeah. And also depends on what champion they are. 
but we should be able to bait him out a little bit, I think. Um, I don't really have any stuns, but Jax does have the stun. I have the knockout, but I, I have to power that up a little bit. Takes a, takes a quick minute. Okay, we are loading a little bit long into this game. I think someone may have uh, may have DC'd or something, I'm not sure. But usually it, it's pretty quick loading into the game on beginner and on intermediate bots because uh, mostly, mostly the uh, bot accounts that the people that make to level up accounts and then sell them once they're like level 30 or whatever, usually those accounts aren't aren't in the beginner and intermediate levels. So that is interesting. But yeah, all right. I don't know if that means like someone in this, like maybe the Jinx possibly, is um, is not an actual player or what. Like it might be a bot account, but either way. <clears throat> I'm, pr I'm almost certain this is not a bot, and I'm almost cer I'm definitely certain this is not a bot. Um, this one I don't think is a bot, but maybe. Um, but this one is like the most bot looking. I mean, no offense, they might be a person, and if they are, awesome, that's good. But uh, we are taking forever to load in, which makes me wonder. Uh, usually it does not take for that long. So all right, anyways, let's get into it. I'm uh, gonna buy everything like normal, and then jump up in here. Go into top lane. I think the the base jack skin looks pretty nice, actually. Has it always been like that? Looks really cool, actually. Oh, is Jax going mid? Okay, interesting. All right, <clears throat> let's see who our opponent is going to be in top lane. Is it going to be Urgots? Yes, it is Urgot. Okay. So yeah, Aurelia mid then, and then got the uh, Ezreal and Galio bots. Follow the wind. Oh, I missed. But watch your back. Minions have spawned. The road to ruin is shorter than the Nice. That's what we like to see. <laughs> we'll go ahead and place this just for fun, and then we get a quick bonus thing here. And then we probably just TP back, I think. Smartest choice. I wonder if the uh, the other guy will TP back. They do have TP. Uh, they have teleport, so you would think that they might. They have the new AI. But uh, it looks like he's probably just walking back to lane. I mean, that's honestly not the worst choice, like, just in a normal game either. In that situation. But uh, the early XP is very important. Missing out on that is bad. Absolutely. Yeah, this, this AI doesn't seem as good for sure. All right, cool. Maybe maybe top lane is the new play then. <laughs> maybe it is. All right, let's go ahead and get our first uh, demolish proc here. Looks like uh, our Diana is AFK. Is that what happened then? Virtue is no more than a luxury. Nice, we celebrated. <laughs> I'm taking a lot of damage from these minions, but I really want this uh, thing. I really want that turret plate if I can get it. I think we'll stick around, honestly. <clears throat> Could be a mistake, but I think we'll be alright. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to take that turret shot, though. That was not great. Could stay in one place. An enemy has been slain. There we go, nice. Get a little bit more turret damage, then we'll probably go ahead and recall here. Pretty soon at least. Yeah, see the the damage fortification here? It's it actually blocks a ton of damage, that's crazy. Absolutely nutty. Yeah, we do have an AFK. That is sad, but obviously I don't want to remake or anything. It's not not a big deal. It's just a bot game. 
wanderer isn't always lost. Oh no, he's gonna kill me with this freaking shield! Oh man, I can't believe his E came back up that quickly. That's so crazy. Whoops, made a mistake there. Oh well. Oh well. All right, let's go back into building what we were doing. Get another uh, longsword, I think. Oh, did he just go ahead and recall after the, that kill? Interesting. I didn't, haven't seen his TP yet. Maybe he'll do it. <gasps> Excuse me. Or maybe he'll just uh, save it. Save it right now. I don't know. My honor left a long time ago. Rip. Too bad the uh, the actual player DC'd. All right, he should be pretty much back to lane now. Let's try to get this demolish proc off at least, and then we can kind of back off the wave a little bit. Yeah, he dodged my Q there is what what would actually killed me there, honestly. If he hadn't have dodged that Q um, in the previous fight, I mean, we would have been fine. There we go. I'm go ahead and take him out. Actually, I think I'll stay over here for a second. Try to take out this minion wave real fast. There we go. Free damage on the turret here. Just took a little bit of damage, but we do have the life steal, so that's nice. <clears throat> All right, it is five minutes now, so actually we will we will do pretty much full damage besides the uh, plating bulwark that comes out to defend the turrets. I was kind of wondering if he was going to do that. It's fine though. Alright, nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Go ahead and try to clear this wave as well. And then we don't have enough for the uh, item yet now. Okay. I didn't think so, but I just wanted to double check. Try to get some more damage on this. Definitely at least another demolish proc. Yeah. Twenty-six fifty. So we need about five hundred more gold, roughly. Five fifty. All right. We didn't quite get the turret there, but we should be able to get it next. Uh, little bounce. He's gonna be back though, so we're gonna have to fight him first. I think, unless he went mid or something. I missed that cannon by pressing E. Whoops. That was a mistake. Yeah, he's still not here. That's kind of weird. Oh well. It's not the end of the world. So we now have enough for our item, so we should probably go ahead and grab it real quick, to be perfectly honest with you. But I mean, if no one's going to contest us, I'll just take the free da turret damage, honestly. We do have Nocturne over here. I'm gonna watch out for him a little bit. He's probably gonna come to gank. Oh yeah, the the Urgot did die there somehow from someone. I, I wasn't really paying attention. Maybe it was bot lane. Maybe it was mid. But somewhere he ended up falling. Yeah, we're getting some nice damage on the turret for sure. Uh, he does a uh, bone plating as well. That's always fun. <laughs> Alright, we're going to go ahead and recall and then teleport back. <clears throat> He's going to find us, isn't he? Go! 
Alright, if he wants to kill us, if he wants to stop our back this time, he dying. Yep, we're good. Alright, nice. Let's get cracking. And then let's uh, start on our uh, Infinity One Edge. It's gonna be big, the buffed Infinity Edge. <laughs> and continue on. Uh, yeah, like I said in the previous video, uh, these videos are these video or these games are not uh, no longer gonna be, you know, the uh, the nice little ten minute games. You can't make nice, good stuff. We got that. Wonder how many? Oh, it looks like they only got one. Okay. I'll give you the easy way out. Cool. Getting those is pretty big, to be honest. And stopping him, obviously, from getting more as well is really good. For sure. Bye. One blade, one purpose. All right, <clears throat> let's try to finish off this turret here. We should be able to pretty easily, to be honest. Do have more grubbies spawning, but not not very, very soon. In fact, they might despawn pretty soon after they uh, spawn in, just because just because of the. Um, Sorry, I had to concentrate for there a second there. Uh, just because of the uh, Rift Herald spawn timer being very soon after. And they despawn once Rift Herald comes in, so... Probably gonna probably gonna lose those guys. But yeah, top lane seems actually to be a little bit better of a lane now. Nice. Alright, we have enough for our next item. I kinda don't really want to recall right now, but I'm probably gonna have to. I think they're all gonna start coming pretty soon here. How pushed I am. Can't run away from my auto attacks, that's for sure. Can't dodge those very easily. Alright, nice. Oh no. Yeah, the taunt is gonna be annoying for sure. <laughs> I just want to get a demolish proc off if I can. I definitely need to get more uh, more items before I do a whole lot more here. Alright, let's see if we can kind of hide for a second and recall for items real fast. But yeah, they play so different now, it's crazy. He's got four bonus streets. Man, this guy has not been jungling very much, actually. <laughs> I mean, he's definitely done some, but just not a whole lot. All right, next up is going to be our uh, Ravenous Hydra. Although, to be honest with you guys, I'm not worried about the Ravenous as much as I am about getting Holebreaker. I think Holebreaker is going to be pretty nice for us. Let's go ahead and get Berserker Greaves just because, and then I think I'll get this. If I sell this, how much do I get? I can get this. Reduces our... Uh, I think I'm going to keep the Dorans for now, actually. Oh, we got the Jinx Rocket coming in. And it swings wide, unfortunately. It's like a... Oops. Rough flash there, buddy. I believe in you, though. Maybe. Actually, no, I don't. Never mind. <laughs> oh, never mind. Hold up. The W. If you can stop hitting the minions, you might... Ah, uh, okay. Unlucky. Good effort. Good effort. Good try. Alright, we have like... 20 seconds to kill these void grubs. Let's see if we can do it. I should have gone straight there. Come on. 
16 seconds. Yeah, we did it in time. Nice. Let's go. And then Harold's coming up. I'm actually going to go ahead and take Harold on, actually, to be honest. Then we can uh, finish off this entire little thing. Alright, nice. Let's drop this bad boy mid and let's just get in there. Actually, I'll just teleport and, and drop it then. Oh, freaking both the turrets are all gone actually. Never mind. It's fine. Okay, it completely missed the base. I don't know how that happened, but alright. Let's go ahead and end the game here. Alright, GG. <laughs> uh, yeah, Yasuo definitely seems like one of the best to do uh, to do boss with now, and I think top lane is actually a pretty good, pretty good shout actually. So that one actually wasn't too bad overall, I would say, um, as opposed to the intro boss was a little bit more difficult, I would say. Uh, did I go deathless there? I actually can't. I don't remember. I think I died once, right? Didn't I die once? Also, apparently they actually reset all my progress, so I no longer have like. 2000 or whatever it was uh, wins and just a few losses from when I first started the game. I did die once. Okay, unfortunate. Uh, Jax almost did as much damage as me, actually. All, obviously, all the enemies were coming mid and bot, so yeah, makes sense. But yeah, either way, thank you for watching the beginner bots. Um, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you once again, and I'll catch you in the next one. We'll be doing intermediate. Peace.